Does low testosterone lead to hair loss? Are you starting to lose your hair and wondering if your low testosterone may be a culprit behind hair loss? My name is Dr. Terranella, and in this video, we're going to look at the role of testosterone on hair follicles and hair growth. So if you're interested in expanding your health awareness and you like this kind of information on health, nutrition, hormones, and things like that, click on the like button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel to get more videos like this one. Now for a quick disclaimer, the information in this video is for informational purposes only. It's not intended as a treatment for any health condition or as a substitute for seeing an actual doctor or medical profession. It should be used as an educational guide to deeper your understanding of your own health and treatment success. If medical attention is needed, don't delay in seeking that attention. All right, let's look at this question. Does low testosterone lead to hair loss? Does low testosterone lead to hair loss? Yes, actually low testosterone does lead to hair loss, but not the hair on your head. Low testosterone does cause loss of hair on the body. Oftentimes it shows up as decreased hair on the lower legs. You'll see finer hairs, kind of more like female body hair. But low testosterone absolutely does not lead to loss of hair on the head. In fact, the opposite is true. Testosterone does go down with age and people do tend to, especially males, lose more hair as they age and females. However, it's not due to the testosterone going down. It's more of the cumulative effect of the testosterone and overall androgens in the body, in the blood, over time that deteriorates the hair follicles. On the, head. the testosterone derivative known as DHT or dihydrotestosterone is thought to be the main culprit for damaging the hair follicles on the scalp. The DHT leads the hair follicles to be less active, grow less often, be finer in nature, and eventually the cumulative effect of that causes those hair follicles to die. Over time, the more DHT around to affect the hair follicles, the less the hair follicles are going to grow. The more exposure to DHT, the less likely for the hair follicles to be active and growing. And that's why things like finasteride and dutasteride are used for hair loss because they block the production of DHT. Now, of course, there are other mechanisms of why humans lose their hair and other theories and thoughts on why this happens. But there's lots of evidence for the DHT model, and I think it is probably the most relevant. But in terms of does low testosterone lead to hair loss on your head, the answer is absolutely not. The opposite is true. In fact, high testosterone and high DHT lead to more facial hair, arm hair, back hair, and basically hair all over your body, except on the top of your head. So don't think that raising your testosterone is going to make the hair on your head grow more because it will likely do the opposite. All right, that's all I have for this video on does testosterone lead to hair loss? So what do you think? Do you have any experience with testosterone helping or hurting hair loss? Let me know in the comment section. And if you do have any questions on this topic, Drop it in the comment section as well. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time.